it is the finals of the Grand Prix Chess Tournament 2022 League 3. The series is coming to an end. Hikaru Nakamura won League Number 1. League 2 was won by Richard Rapport. And let's see who wins League 3. And without any further ado, let's get straight into the game. So Wesley so responds with d4. Nakamura responds with knight f6, d4, e6, knight c3, and bishop b4. The names are Indian. Win c2. And he pushes e4 here. Now here he'll have to create double pawns because if he takes with the queen, he'll lose the pawn. Black plays d5, e5, knight e4, pins the knight. White plays bishop d3 as this is already defended by the queen and the pawn. And now bishop d3 threatens bishop into f7. Black plays c5, knight f3, c into d4. Finally, they break the tension in the center, knight into d4, knight d7. Bishop to f4, defending this pawn and queen h4. Now, this is looking like a very complicated game. There are a lot of things under attack. g3, queen h5, castles, and he castles in this position when his light squares are weak. But black has also not developed his light square bishop, so it looks kind of safe. g5 by Hikaru, he is attacking here. c to d5, even though your bishop is under attack, you have attacked black knight now because this pawn was defending it earlier. Bishop into c3, b into c3, e into d5 supports the knight, bishop has to move back, knight into e5 now, this pawn is undefended, f3, knight c5, both the knights attack the bishop, so the bishop moves, here black doesn't trade it because otherwise white pieces will come in the game, so knight e6, rook a e1, knight into d4, bishop into d4, and it looks like black king is weak, knight c6, f4, knight into d4, now he has traded this bishop which was controlling this diagonal, c into d4, this queen is defending this pawn, g into f4, rook into f4, now it looks like white is coming with a strong attack, here black exchanges the bishop, rook takes, queen at 6, and now it is a major piece endgame, queen and 2 rooks versus queen and 2 rooks, and black has 5 pawns versus white's 4 pawns, but white is attacking, Queen c7, rook a c8, queen e5, now rook g5 is a threat, he plays f6, queen into d5, now it's equal pawns now, king h8, queen into b7, rook c2, white is also on the 7th rank, black is also on white second rank, rook f2, white immediately removes the rook out of the second rank, but black's queen comes in, queen goes to g2 to defend the king, queen h5, and both players agree to a draw because there's nothing much happening here. White can just go back and they can again be a check. And black has also depended on everything here. So the first game ends in a draw. Tomorrow will be the second game. And if that game also ends in a draw, it will go to the tie So this was the recap of game one in the finals. This is the request. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in my next video.